This video might be a little intense, um, but to make it less intense, I got Gears of War Tactics playing in the background, so maybe that'll even things out, but I doubt it. Um, if you're watching this, I'm going to set this to come out on Thursday. It'll be the 13th, I believe. Yeah, it'll be thir the 13th. This should come out. Uh, I'm going to schedule it to come out uh, sometime in the evening. Um, so, as of right now, I should be in the hospital uh, getting done with my surgery. Uh, I'm going in for a um, gastric sleeve and a hiatal hernia refill, which you guys know me, I have really bad like health in terms of, like diabetes, high blood pressure, sleep apnea, because I don't take care of myself. But I, I've been doing good. I've been doing good. Uh, and this is the reason why I'm doing this, because I feel like this is my chance to do it do it and stick with it um i've seen a lot of people that's had it done and there's some success and I've seen people that's had it done and they haven't been so successful and i like to be one of those people that's successful years down the road i don't want to gain all the weight back and i don't want to have this nasty uh body i'm sick of I'm tired of I'm tired of being, you know, overweight, and I'm tired of the things that comes with it, you know, like depression, the anxiety, and all the health problems you can think of. And I you know I've said this many times before, it's like, but this time I have to because the route I'm going right now is going to lead me to either die or start losing limbs because I am diabetic and I have been taking care of my sugar there for a while I didn't care um I've got really bad depression and I know you're probably hearing this well everybody's got depression uh, yeah that's yeah, true but <laughs> I've got severe bipolar depression uh, I take meds every night handful of meds uh twice a day and it sucks uh, something I'm not proud of, something that I'm hoping with this surgery later down the road, I can get cut down to half of what I'm taking now. Uh, I need a little bit of boost in the self-esteem department, that's for sure. Um, so right now I should be, if things went well, I should be waking up. I should be in my room and sipping on water and taking walks every hour and yeah i should be really sore apparently as i've heard i'm not 100 percent sure i'm just going by what some people have said um and today would be the beginning of the rest of my life the first day of a new beginning that if that makes sense. A new beginning for my body. Um, and I want to thank all my friends and family that stuck up for me and has supported me throughout this. Uh, I know there's been some people that's not... I didn't think it was a good idea. I don't understand. I know where exactly where you're coming from. And, you know, you have... Uh, yeah, I understand. Yeah, I'm I'm nervous making this video. I'm actually nervous making any videos because I'm getting back into the swing of things. So this is the scary part. So uh, my brother told me, you know, which I don't think he was trying to scare me. I guess somebody he knew um, had the surgery, and during the surgery they clipped something, and they almost lost that person and that's got me scared and there's some other people it's like oh don't go do it at king's daughters you'll die or something and i'm like i'm gonna die eventually i guess i'm not really afraid of dying 
So if it's one of those things, if I do die, that's I'm ready for it. I, I don't care. It doesn't bother me. It, it sucks for everybody that has to deal with it. I hate that. I want to live, though. I like to live. I like to continue doing what I'm doing. Uh, letting life get better because slowly life is starting to pick up again, which is awesome. Even though uh, 2020 has been hell for everybody else. So I'm hoping right now I'm doing great. I'm hoping, you know, I'm <laughs> in my room and starting to take water in and uh, you know, hoping a few days I can go home. So I hope. I hope so. Maybe. And you know, uh, my girlfriend, I'm, I'm hoping she, she's okay. My mom, my, my brothers, my sister, my other family, my friends, I hope they, you know, I'm, I hope they're okay. Um, and if I'm not okay, then I love you guys and I'll keep fighting and stuff. I'll keep fighting until beat it or not beat it i'm acting like this is going to be my last day on earth which it's not or it could be surgery is you know it, you, there's a risk for any type of surgery and you're going under and you know i'm not too worried about it honestly it's it's not too i'm not concerned just a little bit concerned i think I think the close closer it gets, the more concerned I get. Um, and just more people keeps on telling me different stories, and I'm just like, man, I wish you didn't tell me that. You know, that's, that's something I didn't want to know. I really didn't want to know that at all. Like at all, I didn't want to know it. I'm just hoping uh, whatever they. Put me on um, after the surgery uh, has me high as a kite. I, I would be fine with that. Just, just give everything to me, except for morphine. Morphine freaks me out. Like it, it just freaks me out. I don't understand because it makes my skin crawl and I hallucinate and all that shit. Um. So uh, when this video comes out. If you don't care, can you share it um, on my Facebook? Um, that would be amazing. Um, if something bad happens, then obviously there's nothing we can do about it. But just say something happens and I'm not here anymore today. Just want to say I love you guys. And thank you for being my friend, my family, and thank you for everything. I hope I can see you on the other side. If there is another side, I, there might be. I'm verdict's still not out 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 on that. I guess I'm trying to figure that out. <laughs> but I'm I'm assuming once you know. Next Thursday, I'll get out of here, and this video premieres. I'll get to look at it. It's like, man, that's being over dramatic. But you know what? Maybe it's something I should have put out in the first place. Maybe it's maybe it's a good idea to get kind of clear the air. Because it could could be my last chance to do that. Last chance to say goodbye, or this could be my new chance to say hello. My new chance to say, hey, here's me. A year down the road, I am half the size I am now. That would be amazing. If I fought half through all the meds, no longer have to worry about seeing a psychiatrist. Hopefully, that, that would be amazing. I hope. But, like I said, um, feel free to share this. I love you guys. And take care. And I'll talk to you soon. Hopefully.